constructing a 30 degree angle to construct this angle we are going to need our ruler our protractor or our compass and our protractor and we will use the protractor to measure the angle to confirm when we are finished uh, with the construction okay so let us um, first draw a line this line is going to be one of the legs of the angle so let's draw it to the 8 um, centimeters long so 8 centimeters so there we have a line we can name the line let us call it the line A B so there we have the line A B now to construct the 30 degree angle we're going to construct the angle at the point A so since we're going to construct it at the point A we're going to use A as our first center we're going to center the compass at A first, right? And then uh, make an arc to intersect the line AB in the manner shown. So we make the arc for about a quarter of a circle, of a circle, a bit above that. So there we have our arc. Now, the intersection that was created, we will use that as another center for the compass. And you're going to make an arc now to intersect the first arc made in this manner. Make this one again to about a quarter of a circle in the direction shown. And then now this other intersection created we use as another center for the compass. So we center the compass there. And then you're going to make just as arc large enough to intersect the previous one made. So there we have it. Now back for the ruler. We're going to draw a line now through that last intersection and the point A, a straight line, of course. And that line will create a 30 degree angle with the line AB at the point A. So let's see if that will work out for us. Let's just draw that line. To the last intersection and the point A. There we have the line. Now we're going to use the protractor to confirm whether this is a third degree angle or not. So we're going to center the compass at the vertex of the angle, which we chose to be the point A originally. Then we're going to ensure that um, the zero line on the compass is in line with one of the legs of the angle. Here it is in line with line AB, that's one leg, and then let us take our measurement, here it is, 30 degrees, the other leg goes right to 30 degrees, that means this angle is in fact a 30 degree angle. So there we have it, a 30 degree angle.